Alright, part two of my Razor Black Widow video review. So I'm reviewing the Black Widow Ultimate and the standard Black Widow. It's the standard version. From what I can see the software is exactly the same. Except for one says Black Widow Configurator and the other says Black Widow Ultimate Configurator. So I'll show you on the Ultimate. Um, okay, assign keys. So basically you can click on any key. Sorry, there's the pointer there. So you can see as I move it over a key it goes green and it shows you which key it is there as well. So if I click on that, okay, then all these down here go green. So before I clicked on it they were all grey. So they go green which means they become customizable. Um, so I can set up any key on the keyboard to be a profile switch, launch a program, uh, that default key just puts it back to what it was, the um, default I mean. Um, you can set it up to act as another key and you can set it up to initiate a macro. Okay, so I've set up these M keys down the side here to launch apps, programs. So as you can see down here in the little handy diagram, Firefox is assigned to the top M key. Steam is assigned to the second one, and so on and so forth. Manage profiles, second page, there's three pages. So yeah, just set up your profile, name it. You can import and export profiles in case you need to reinstall Windows or something. Um, and then the macro section, I don't use macros at all, so I haven't played around with this at all yet, but obviously um, highly configurable. Lots of options here. I'll just um, go over it here slowly for people who are interested. So that's where your list of macros will come up. Um, yeah, I don't think you can really see those, but from the left to the right, there's a like a rewind button, record button, play button, stop button, and a fast forward button. Um, up here, so macro name, delay in milliseconds, basic commands, additional commands, ignore delays between events during recording, you can, you can tick that, insert default delay which is 50 milliseconds. So that's it, that's your software for the Black Widow. Um, and as I, oh yeah that takes you to the, um, where I just clicked up the top right hand corner there, takes you to the website, we can download the drivers, the support site, and then you've got your driver version and firmware version down the bottom there. Yeah, so it's the same for both the um, Black Widow Ultimate and the standard Black Widow. Okay.